What's up guys, it's Ori, and we are back in the Sweden is not overpowered campaign, which is fake news. Moving on, last time we got our independence uh, uh, sorted out from Denmark, as well as taking Jampland from Norway. We could take that province, make our borders along here a little bit more contiguous. Also, we ended up getting this wasteland, because, yeah, that just adds to the size of our country. This time, I think we're gonna we're going after Novgorod for sure. I was debating between episodes uh, whether we're going to take uh, Neva and Ingermanland, but I don't think we are because Muscovy wants those two provinces, and we are allied to the Russian bear right now. So I think we're kind of just gonna leave those be. We'll end up taking like Kola, White Karelia, maybe Kare maybe Karelia itself or Liska. I don't know. Let's look at the actual province names. Yep, that is Karelia. So we might take these three provinces just to kind of expand a little bit since Novgorod is getting picked up by Muscovy. Hmm. Scotland wants an alliance. They're allied with France. That could... Hmm. Nope. No, we have no chance with France since we're allied with Austria. No, we will not take an alliance. Sorry, Scotland. You're on your own. Go ahead. We can lower maintenance for right now while we're waiting on uh, those claims to fabricate so we can make some money. Uh, I see our galleys got built. Good, good, good. Yeah, let's just go. We do have some loans to pay off, unfortunately. Hmm. Oh, Norway has a claim on us. Ah, it doesn't matter. We have a pretty long truce with Norway and Denmark, so that's good. We'll be okay. Gonna have to rebuild our navy, unfortunately. Oh, French Pope. Okay. Not like that matters anyway, because, yeah. We're gonna become Protestant as soon as that happens. Speaking of which... Ah, it's gonna take a while. Okay. Yeah. Yep, nice and mellow little beginning to this part. Which will more than likely escalate into an all-out war against Novgorod. Uh, ooh, ooh, why advancement of the clergy? Why now? I don't like that. Really don't like that. Oh, let's just pray we don't get advancement of the nobility. Burgers, can I do anything with you? No, can I do anything with you? Hmm. Nope. Nope, we're not doing that. All right, let's see. Still getting our, still getting Yomplund cord. That's okay. The unrest is pretty nasty, so we're just gonna bump up autonomy, so we don't have to deal with that. It's only one province, fortunately. Looks like Novgorod is building troops. Let's go ahead and check the list, see what their army looks like. Rivals. Ow. Oh no, we're gonna just smash Novgorod. Even if they, yeah, even if we had nothing but infant, it, that infantry, we would smash them because we're Sweden, and our infantry is OP. Oh, it's beautiful. That 20% infantry combat ability right out of the gate. Oh, that's pretty. Renaissance. Okay, so the Renaissance is spawned now. Let's see where did it spawn actually. Oh, of course it spawns in Italy. Always spawns in Italy. Um, well, not always, but it's pretty rare it spawns elsewhere. Most of the time, nobody else has time to develop uh, high enough to get it before uh, it fires. Yeah, that was a good sentence. Good job. All right. So, yeah, we have... Oh, I accepted that, didn't I? Oops. Uh, I did not want to accept that. Yay for misclicks. <laughs> Damn it. Mm, no, we're not going to have a royal marriage with you. Let's go ahead and make Yompland into a state. Burn a little more admin. Oh, only 15. That's not bad. That is a pretty... That isn't the best province in the world, but... It does make our borders a little prettier. Let's get our claims on Novgorod before Muscovy decides they just want to murder them. Hmm. Actually, how long is their truce with Muscovy? 63. You know, I think we'd have time to expand enough by then. That's, what, 13 years? 
about. Okay. Let's see. Ooh. Uh, nobility want more land. Why? Is this a three dev? Yes, you can have this, this little three development province right here. Now quit complaining. Thank you. Yeah, I think we are just going to go for it, honestly. Let's see. We only have Humiliate Rival CB. Yeah, let's just get Neva. Let's see if we can get our claims on these two real quick. We're just going to go for it. Keep relations high with the Russian Bear. Hmm. Who else could we see about getting an alliance with? The Teutons. Ooh. Ooh. Um. But we need the Teuton land. Hmm. That isn't, that's a tough call. That is definitely a tough call. I want to go after Mecklenburg, but we we would have to declare a no CB war. And in Europe, that is a terrible idea. So we're not going to do that. Income's coming up quite nicely. I actually have a decent little chunk of change. Manpower is kind of low, unfortunately. So maybe it's time to start swapping some of these units out for uh, Mercs. Well, we do have two units of mercs, but I think we need some more, maybe. We'll see. Neva doesn't have a fort. Ingermanland doesn't... Ingermanland doesn't have a fort. Good. Seven development, seven development. Yeah, now this is perfect. Soon as we can get our claim on Ingermanland as well, we'll probably go to war. Which means we should kick army maintenance up right now. So it's time to tick back up before this happens. Go ahead and turn on this fort. Oh, we still have a lazy diplomat. Um, hmm. Let's just go ahead and get uh, Spy Network going in Denmark. That'll be okay. One more month and our morale should be full. No, two more. Uh, yeah, no, we're gonna absolutely give you 10 Diplo power. That's fine. Using a little money still. That should go away, though, as soon as war taxes come online. Okay, we can now get our claim here. I think we're just gonna go for it, unfortunately. I know M Muscovy's not gonna be super pleased about it, but they're already fighting a war in the south. From the looks of things. Yeah, yeah, no, they're going after Ryzen, the Great Horde. So they're going to be occupied for a little while. This is okay. This is totally fine. We can just kind of casually sneak in, grab these two little provinces. Get our spy network stopped there. Yeah. Yeah, we're just going to go for it. Go take the two war goals. Or what is the war goal actually? Which one did we declare over? Ingerman Lend. That's okay. Uh, you have two ships. We're just gonna send uh, our navy over there, I suppose, to what little navy we have left over there. Uh, re yes, we can afford to repay a loan right now. Let's also kick up war taxes. How much did that jump our economy up? Nice. Nice. Detach one here, go get this 10 to 1 for the war score. Okay. I don't want to get this guy too far away from the main army. Okay, we have taken the uh, war goal, which is good. Go ahead and send the main army up here. Livonian. The Livonian Order hates us. That's okay. I'm fine with this. I wonder what Muscovy thinks of us doing this right now. In fact, actually, let's go just hunt down the Novgorodian army. Oh, I think we're going to get him right here. Yep. Bye. Yep. Bye. All right, so we'll move into here. Okay, we have that province occupied. Go ahead and get this one. As soon as the army gets into White Corellia, we'll half and half. That, let's see, we need one, two, three, four, five, six. 
do that. You guys can go there. You guys can go there. Probably should have waited. Well, no, actually, I don't know. Why are we taking attrition? Oh, the supply limit. And we'll go here. No, you guys go there. Let's see. You guys go there. And you guys go there. Okay, that should work. I think I missed a couple of provinces, though. That's okay, though. Yep. We'll have it sorted. Right now. Well, there's the rest of the Novgrodian fleet. Apparently, we are being blockaded. Oh, this... That's being blockaded. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, this war's over. That was quick and easy. Oh, that's a fort. Okay. That's a capital fort. Um, that's just infantry, right? That's just infantry. Send you over. Uh, send the cavalry out so you're not taking extra attrition. Aha! Our royal marriage is over with Austria, unfortunately. But they are still the emperor of the Holy Roman Empire, which is awesome. Go ahead and get a royal marriage. Uh, we can turn off a couple of forts at this point. We don't need to be paying for all of these right now. Actually, we don't need to be paying for any of them right now. We should have just gone through the menu to do that. Oh, well. Yay, Austria still loves us. Spy network in Denmark. Oh, we had to take a loan, unfortunately. Yep, renewing our loans. That's what it was. Let's see. Yeah, let's just go ahead and get a claim on Blacking. There's our Conquest CV against uh, Denmark. We can take it to speed 5 because we're sieging. This is going to take a while, so... Well, shouldn't take too long. It's only a capital for it. Taking attrition while we're doing that. That's fine. Come on. Yay. Yep. You guys can go back over to there. We'll have to rebuild our navy after this. I just wanted to consolidate real quick. Because we do need these two provinces for the achievement. So that's the main goal of this war was to get the those two before Muscovy did. Still a bold move though. Bold move. I want these two. Um, about that. 28 aggressive expansion. That's not bad. Yeah, I'll take those. And all your money, which is pitiful. Um, end our rivalry for the prestige. Only gets us 10. I'm okay with this. Yeah. Yay! Quick and easy war against Novgorod. Alright, so... We're going to... We're going to definitely core the more expensive ones first. Ingerman, Lind, and Neva. Glad we had the cores on those, though. Made it a little cheaper. Hey, you guys go here. Drop her back down to speed four. Yeah, I think we're okay with this. Let's see, what is Muscovy's opinion of us? That dropped quite a bit because we have uh yeah, he wants those two provinces. Ooh, I didn't realize he wanted this one too. Um Here, I got an idea. Can I sell this to you, Muscovy? Do you want to buy Kaxholm from me? Because I will sell it to you. You can't have Ingerman and Neva. Ingermanland and Neva, you can't have, but We'll sell you Kexholm. Ah, uh, Muscovy's at war. So I'll try and sell them Kexholm as soon as uh, they're out of this war down here. Hmm. Uh, this is going to be tough. We need some big allies. What about Austria? Or Hungary? Bleh. Hungary likes Austria. Hmm. Go ahead and rival the Livonians back. Uh, that's not super helpful, though. You guys would take an alliance, which I'm not real interested in. Hmm. How about Brandenburg? 
Yeah, it could be helpful. Uh, I mean, we are allied with Scotland, unfortunately. I'm just going to cut this alliance off now because I don't want to get pulled into anything over in the British Isles. Um, hmm. I suppose we can get a spy network going in uh, Pomerania. That will take that free stability, absolutely. Love free stability. I just watch this is going to be a negative one stability event, like immediately. Hmm, should I be a bro and help Muscovy out? Our manpower is kind of hurting right now, but still. I think we absolutely should be a bro and help Muscovy out. Any little way to get Muscovy to like us is a good thing. Oh no! See? See? What just what did I just say? Oh come on, game, you're killing me. Oh, our current ruler was pretty crap anyway, so that's okay. Uh we'll get a royal marriage with Muscovy again. Oh, we still have it, okay. Yep, that's right, because they offered it, so their ruler is still good. Wait, do I still have units somewhere? I do. Whoops. Not my finest moment. Yeah, you guys can march on home now. Forgot you were there. Alright, let's see. Right. Show me the province river crossings. Um. Oh, that was our loan. Uh, can we repay one? Yeah, let's go ahead and repay that one. Now we're down to what? One? Yes, one. So we'll make this quick. Make this very quick against uh, kind of military access, actually. Um, screw the pie net spy network in uh, Pomerania. Go ahead and ask for military access so we can go to Vishni, whatever this is. Not get a river crossing penalty against these rebels. I don't know why I'm doing this. Maybe to make the Russian bear like me a little more? Yeah, probably. How's our Novgorodian separatism looking? Not good. Not good at all. Alright, what is our leader half 331? And begin! You better like me for this, Muscovy. Oh! Whoops. Alright, never mind. Never mind. Bye, Muscovy. You're on your own. You must have teched up. Yep. Yep, never mind. I was never there. Nobody saw that. That never happened. That never happened. Anyone who says so is spreading fake news. It's just fake news. Okay, we gotta kick down maintenance now, because we can't afford this shit. Um, there we go. That hurt. Oh, the bastards moved into our land. Oh, that's not good. Um, how far off Miltech are we? Quite a ways, unfortunately. Damn. Um, we are still focusing on military. Uh, da -da, we can't afford anybody right now. Well, that didn't go well. I forgot that they would, uh, come back. We'll have to turn on Viborg. Yeah, it'll kick. It'll tick on in time for, uh, before they move. Damn it. All right. They just sit there. That's going to kill. Uh, I think we have to bump up autonomy just for the unrest. This is unfortunate. That is culture. Not real thrilled about that. Yeah, we'll just bump up autonomy so the unrest goes down. About 1.3 years they'll fire. So, Muscovy, help, please. Please. Will you please help me, Muscovy? Your war down here is pretty much over. Help. Help. Novgorodian separatists are ruining my lands that I just took. 
Damn you, Novgorod. Damn you. Well, unfortunately, this is where I think we're going to have to call an episode. So, yeah, that kind of, it went fairly well, I would say. We'll find out what the after effects of this little war were in the next part. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next.